Welcome back everybody, this is Liz Marino 300 speaking, I hope all of y'all enjoyed the previous video, I did kind of enjoy making it, um, also, I'm sorry for not, um, streaming or uploading for a while to everyone, I need to turn that sound down a little bit, um, I can't, oh well, I'm sorry for not, like, streaming and all that for a bit, that's because I've had some technical difficulties with my laptop, as I said before the last stream ended. So, um... I am now probably going to stream a lot less. I'm, I'm still probably going to stream a lot less, and, uh... I will definitely try and continue with streaming, but I might only stream once-ish a month. Because I am going to, uh, not me exactly, but I do want these videos to be edited down. And hopefully it will be better for well everyone. So yeah, I hope all of you can join in on that. I'll probably only have once a month. And I the video will be definitely compressed down. Uh, hopefully be compressed down to a lot shorter. Um, from these possible five to six hour recording sessions. So, let's jump right into this everyone, and I hope we have a blasting time. Blasting time? Yeah, a good time. So, um, I've heard that there are new things, and that's what we should be trying. We, we shall be trying. I shall, we shall be trying new things every single time, uh, new thing, they're almost the entire new category, um, that's around the end of this video, radio, let's get into this, let's get right on into this, oh, I'm so happy to be back, I am happy to be back everyone, um, um, do it in here, go to this, Radio, that, that, yeah. Second of April, okay. Switch message. Right. Uh, where's the sound? Hello? Hello? What were we doing? before uh i have a lot of notifications okay first things first mail an ending of an event enforce the th what Looks like I couldn't participate in an event. Hmm. Radio. I hope he's able to get sound. Ooh. Chungin Veil album. Is there more to a map? Events. Weapons, GCT, that, that. Is there any new characters? Um, first off, let's go here. Is this an event? Time remaining nine days, must be. Time remaining one day, I have no idea what this stuff is. Test running, Chori, Ida, Corin, GCT, no. Must be a new person. So, we're gonna probably do these ones. First one will be up would be this one. Ooh. Yeah, we'll probably be them ones. Is there more map? Oh, wait, no. I thought they released more map while I was gone. I'm just going to be like, wait, what? I, I need to go in here. Oh, no. 
once there was a glorious kingdom established. Sorry, yes, we will skip it because we've seen it like a bunch of times. Right, um, this up here. Uh, yep. There will be two because I did log in not that long ago because I was finally able to re get my account back. Oh, yes. Oh, that would be useful. Um, I guess we're getting stuff. I have no idea what quest we were doing before as well. Uh, missions? No, that's map. Missions is J? Yes. We were doing something. We needed to go to Master Gene. This one here. Okay. We're not doing that. Oh, I want to do these. Yeah, we shall... I shall go to, like, this stuff. Um... Uh, my brain's still trying to get into the swing of things, okay? Um, all four of them are there. Yep, yeah, let's go to Anthony then. Oh, I am so glad to be back! <laughs> Welcome! I am so... Right, um... Oh wait, I almost forgot some. This stuff. Is this a rerunning or not? I'm not sure. I need to try for that weapon. What is this gear? Oh! For Garming, hold up. For Garming, energy recharge. If it was crit damage, it's Alt F3, right? For Wish? Yeah, it is. I would want that. What's this? Hold up. Whoa, 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 wait a minute. What is this? Uh, I don't know, who, who's that? That's D Luke, I know him. I don't know him. Is this new character? Never seen this person in my life. That looks fancy. Physical damage bonus. That could do be good on my main character. But I want that other thing, the giant crit rating thing. Physical damage bonus. I don't even know what this is for. Crit rate basic attack. This is for air. Aero damage. Right. Aero damage. Aero damage. This one's ice. No, sacred winds. This one's aerostone? I don't know. Um, what if I confirm this selection? Uh, I don't know what to do. Oh well. Um, let's currently hold on that. Let's do the trials test run so I can see how to run these two and see if I would want to draw them. And then we shall do main, uh, what is it? Side quests and, uh, like dailies.
and then we can go to the event quest. I have no idea if this is a new character or not. I think they are. I see dual weapons. Nice and spicy. Yeah, everybody stand back. I am the cutting edge of fashion. It's nothing. Come on. be really cool. Alright, let's try this one. Uh, we can try Gory on this as well. What is Okay, here actually quite good. If like we have like the right stuff on them. Okay, wow. Now Gore, we kind of tried to disguise it. Leave it out to me. It's no charge. It does have a crystallize effect. Teamwork is dream work. Huh? As a good night should. Submit. There's a lot of shields I'm seeing as well. I'm going in. Let's light it up. Oh, I am so rusty. It's a beautiful made wood. So rusty at this. Radio. Is this? Is this the sleeping girl? Is this the sleeping girl? Might be. No, I don't think so. This will burn. I must leave no stone. Flags up and leap. I won't be able to get this spear thing down. Break a leg. As you wish, Ming Fräulein. I summon thee. Time to clean up. Okay. Yeah. Flags 
fly. Observe. For the wicked. Steady as stone is a good night shot. Okay. That's kind of a good character. Although I wouldn't main or use them if I was to get them. The only one I think I'd use is that first one. Now door. I have no idea what she does. Come a little closer. So with this one here, and I hold them. This. Let's spark things up. Oh. Figure out what just happened, please. <laughs> You've been a naughty boy. <laughs> Surrender in our region. quite cool although the only one i think i'd use is the like the first one i'm just hmm. my fingers can't go to like the number buttons like the two center ones between three and four doesn't work Um, I need... I need to... Oh, you're not in the water this time. Uh, this is just dailies. That's over there. Might be able to knock out two quests with this. First off, I need to heal my characters, though. Oh, then I need to go kill the King Boar as well, so I can get the meat, so I can <laughs> have food. I rem I'm remembering what I was doing and all of that. Yeah, just defeat. Remembering what I was doing. Did these quests kill the King Boar? Then collected? And then cooked? Yeah, I think that was it. Yarn cheer. Yeah, I should keep it on Geo, I think. Yeah! Skyward! Got him! <laughs> Make way for the objective! Oh, oh I forgot this thing. Get with me! Yeah, 
Going off to start streaming. <laughs> I'm already streaming. Not to a lot of people, but I'm still streaming and I'm happy for it. Check on the flowers, they're dead. Dangerous eyes will eat berries. Track it down using elemental sight. Oh, this is gonna be a nuisance. My button for that has since been um, malfunctioning. There we are. I only need to push down heavily on it. Okay, I guess we found our corporate. This boom, 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 boom. Uh, is this another defeating one? Yeah, destroy two Hillel Shell Towers, defeat opponents. I'll go back to you in just a moment. Let me go to Windrise and that, that. In this era of fair winds and gentle rains, one needs not marshal the wits to deliver the rain clouds. Fair winds? I do believe we are currently in a thunderstorm wave. Oh, yeah. Yeah, skyward, got him. Oh, there's a. I have, I have not collected something. That there. Ooh. Wait for it to come back and boom. I want to eventually get all those towers done. down here did I just see a wine glass hold up wait a minute never mind on this fine day the view from the heavens must be magnificent out of here skyward scatter wait, am I able to wait what level am I able to level my characters again that can ascend I I can ascend further than that. Oh, uh, not nah, venturing fifty. I was about to be like, wait, what? I need whatever this is. Drop by them, that person. And I need this. Yep. And then to upgrade you, I need this. Drop by Spectres. Inazuma, don't have enough. And then found in Inazuma as well. I'll use a map for that one, that part. Darming's definitely gonna be not level 80. I thought he would be. Nope, I need a couple more of those and <laughs> the things. I'll definitely use the map for all of that as well. 80, 50, 80, 60. <laughs> Artifacts. I'm not gonna look at artifacts yet. No need. Oh, not right now, people. Oh, oh, 
no. Whoa. Right here. Skyward! Got her! Crumble apart! Lightning terrified! <laughs> Sorry, pal! Got her! Right now, I shall go back and talk to Anthony. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Are you? Yep. There we are. Oh, adventuring higher. That's wonderful. Ah, oh. done all commissions. Claim rewards will be there. Ah, uh, you. Is there one for okay? For those. And now go to here. Climb my way down. Major lag spike. Hold up, turn left. There we go. We can get chilled meat. Up, heats up, and run, 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 run. Make way for 
for the attack. Hold up, hold up, hold up, dude, hold up, dude, hold up, dude. Yeah, but I guess that. actually take that much damage. I'm surprised. Let's go. Great, sun's out. Oh, about time we had some dry heat. It's been so Skyward! <laughs> Add ash Whoops. Dispatch rewards. Claim, dispatch again. None. Claim, dispatch again. Claim, dispatch again. Claim. Oh, five? I can have five now? Hold up. It looks like I'm gonna get a boost while in here. Right, after this part, um, hold up. Hold up. Add Astra Abyssosk. Right here. Um, claim adventure rank rewards. Thank you. And now, wrong button. Add Astra Abyssosk. Yep. Claim Thank daily you for commission. completing today's commissions. Here is your reward. And claim. Here we are. And now, hold up. Put it here. Claim more. Yep. So. Nope. Wheat, I don't need any more wheat. I'm just gonna buy some stuff. You know what? I'm gonna buy out the entire store today. I don't know what for, but one day I'll need all of this. Probably not all the wheat, but... One day I might need all of this. Right, um, another one in over here. Rightio. We get this one, then we gotta go to the inner Zuma one. I still kind of remember how things were going. Don't have too much. 
Now I could make a dish with only like, um, only wheat and stuff. I don't know, but I think I'd have like a lot. I don't know what to use tofu in or almonds. Brushes in eight hours. There's a small chance that we might be here in that time. Probably not, to be honest. Um, was it on this island or this island? I think it was this one. We have a story quest nearby there. That's not what I want to do. What I want to do is go to this person. Um, get all the salt, all the pepper. Yeah. All of that. All of that. Good. I'm probably going to regret this later. Tofu, tofu, tofu. And this weed, which is what I need. Nice. I don't know where that's... I, I, I think to find a bunch of them, we just to go around the beaches and something. But that's not my current quest. My current quest is to do with over here. Tele teleport? We have a quest in teleporting point? Mm -hmm. Hey, no, we can teleport here. I thought it was just put away point or something. We're gonna start the quest when I get. What? Ooh. Um. I do believe um that is this one. Okay. This guy's laughing and crying at the same time, and he looks pretty familiar. It's been a while, do you still remember me? You just remember that nickname? Yeah, it's me. Yep. Um, I don't want to read. I don't want to read. Ah, there's no voices. Using that thing in there, or is that thing just there? Nah, I think we are. You're gonna use that. Are we? That was just a quest complete. Okay, hold up. Figure out what this is. What it is. What it's for. Do you know? Um... Uh... I think... After entering the video and starting the challenge, if you cease movement or stop using skills, you will automatically enter the time dilation state after conducting Anyway, or trying to use the skill time duration will occur normally again. Okay, to the time, you will also obtain a defeating opponents. Once Fearing Force has, has a certain value, you can stop all actions after unleashing certain skills. Okay, there's three. 
short period after using Elemental Burst. What? Okay, um, we can create him. Oh, what? Illusion shattered. Inazuma shines eternal. Necessary stuff. Do I just uh... the temple of wisdom? I see everything. There is no escape. Inazuma shines eternal. Complete? Okay. Um, select stage. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What is this thing even for? Okay, two ice characters. Okay, I guess we're doing this then, to all the way to the end, because this is the final day for it, and I'm also going to try and do the other one, because that... Unleash! Oh, 
Cryo Incarnate! Whirling Snow! <laughs> I got me right now. Take flight. Obey. Manifest. There we are. I think that's all right. I am so confused. <laughs> Okay, be there. I know what I'm going to be creating. I'm not exactly sure, but we shall do all of this. I don't know if there's like. Focus phase will appear at influence during this challenge. Focus phase will become normal planets after this. Grand. Okay. Right here. The process of elimination. Well now. What? A sight to behold. I did it right after a skill. Right. Aha. I see one of them one no. right here. Here you are. Finally. Do I see one of them? The target practice. Emerge. Right now. Oh no. Come on out. <laughs> Nothing lasts forever. Show them. Spread your wings and raise a star. Goodbye. <laughs> Our coming was for top. All was good. Emerge. Right here. Emerge. Bloom is a flower in a 
right here. Right now. Defract. Right here. Uh, hold, hold up, everyone. No, I'm I'm awesome, Mom. Oh, no. It's the moment, everyone. Fire and ice, that will be a freezing combo. Um. Thank you. Um. Just got monster. Hooray. So there, there, and there. Make everyone go kaboom at the start. Yeah. Yeah. Make everyone wet. Have a seat. Yep. I am so lucky that the, the, this thing pauses every single time I stop moving. Right, point five seconds, he's going to tax him. Okay, this thing's dead over there. Over there, 
Over there, over there. Strike up. Yeah, that did strike a bros. You know what? That can that can actually be it. Um, that can actually be the thing. Hooray! You wanna attack me? I'll attack you back. For more. And these guys won't even get touched. There we are. So I can claim... Yeah, I'll do that later. Wait, do I need to claim them to make... Yeah, I need to claim it for that. Um, yeah, I'm not using my character, my one. Oh, wonderful. What period after the normal type, plunger type, or elemental skill? Attacked, I don't care where you are. You. <laughs> Where's the enemies? There. Yes. 
This is free money as well. Okay, an Eris and a lap. And a Hydra. Hmm. Two thousand, nice. Mm -hmm. Both of them are geo, so. Okay. 
This one's got your name on it. Okay. okay, right here. A proper send down from the Stina list. Watch out! Live! Witness my great undertaking! Dead, they're over there now. A proper send down from the Stina with Are we here now? Burst forth. Witness my great undertaking. This one's got your name on it. Okay, that's actually kind of cool. Final one, but Geo again. Okay. Lend me a hand. Right, 
right here. I'm not going to kill silk. How inconsiderate of you. Yeah, very inconsiderate of you. Boom. It's showtime. Boom. Go away. Over there. Okay. Three big guys. I have one. I don't have enough time, do I? I am the cutting edge of fashion. Wow. That is amazing. Right. Leave challenge. That was everything. Right. Aftermath? I wonder if there's more. this quest another place I can teleport to that it is it is wow Productions. This would be so good with voices. So, this one's also with that over there. Rolling crossfire challenge, you must use the remote controlled cannon to fire at the slimes. The more slimes you defeat within the time limit, the higher your test score will be. Large slimes are harder to defeat, but awards but awarded more points once fled. Well. Let's get this done now. One, two. No, 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 I can't be back in that time. I'll only be able to do this first one. <laughs> I don't think I'll be able to stream. Damn. Yeah, I won't be here on that day. Okay. 
acá. On air fire. Things fire differently compared to what you hit them with. This one will go over here then. Hold up. Everything to me. Fire will go to this door. Electro. 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 Nice. Fire. 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 Um. Electro. Ice. 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 Fire, fire, oh yeah, fire. Fire, 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 ice. Uh, okay. I don't know what this is. I will claim it days ahead, like next month. So yeah, does the sound alert still work? Been trying to get things reorganized for a while, do they? Nope, don't think they do. Um, so, um, yes, <laughs> yes, they work. Come on, I need to be back in like three days. By the way, editor that I send this to, um, probably be back in three days to send you more footage. Ah, uh, yeah, hold up. Sorry, my little sister was just at the door. Right. Uh, story quest. Oh yeah, I need a claim. Um, no. Uh, locked, locked, locked. New quest. Things I can unlock, I think. I'm currently doing that quest. Yeah, Jory's a new person. I actually want to get her. Hmm. That's the one we got a master game. Yeah, I thought so. Hold up. Let's, Let's roll for her, eh? It's been a while since I've done this. Come on! Flags by... Okay. What weapon or character? And... As the saying goes, Yinjin. you never truly know someone until you meet them in person. Okay. Anything else? Nope. 
Uh, one more time. Come on. Ah, okay. How does Yinjin gameplay go again? Uh, I, I think this is the second one. Yeah. And uh, that's it, right? Yep. Um, drop. During the Stardust Exchange. I have zero here. I have... Four. I need 160. Just an extra 100 and I can try again. That's all good. That looks different, the quest icon. Wonderful. Yeah! Skyward! Scatter! Let's go! I do want to stream every day, it's just I don't think my editor will be able to keep up with all the streaming. Yeah. <sighs> Thank you for coming on such short notice, Honorary Knight. I know you must be busy. Nope. Well, to make a long story short, there's a particular matter at hand that the Knights requires your assistance with. Yes, it has been one thing after another recently. Neither myself nor any of the Mondstadt garrison are able to catch a moment of peace. I have recently received multiple reports from the Knights of someone within the Lawrence clan having close dealings with the Fatui. Oh, the Fatui? Again? But who are the Lawrence clan? Mm-hmm. There was a dark period in Mondstadt's history when the aristocracy ruled over the city. The hard-won freedom that followed with the fall of Decarabian was lost once again as slavery spread throughout the land. The first Dandelion Knight, Vanessa, spearheaded the revolution that overthrew the old aristocratic system and established the Knights of Favonius, Ooh. leading Mondstadt to become the city that you see today. The aristocrats that had oppressed the people of Mondstadt were none other than the Lawrence clan. Oh, Paimon gets it! So the clan's descendants are now scheming with the bad guys to carry out more dubious deeds! We suspect as much, though we have yet to obtain any solid evidence. The reason I summoned you here today is to ask you to help... <sighs> Unfortunately, the Knights of Favonius and the aristocracy have been at odds with one another for as long as I can remember. We've already considered every possible way of resolving our differences, but it seems the descendants of the aristocracy remain antagonistic towards the knights. No matter what stance we take when dealing with them, the outcome is always the same. Our Imagine efforts only result in that. adding more fuel to the flames. We could come knocking on their door on the grounds of a search warrant, but if the investigation were to come up empty, I'm afraid tensions and distrust would only increase. All of our past efforts would have been wasted. You are in fact the best candidate to represent the Knights of Favonius. But you need not emphasize your role as the Honorary Knight. You are a traveler from a distant land, and you can approach the aristocrats in this way. Mm -hmm. Once you come to friendly terms with the Lawrence clan, you should be in a good position to learn more of their possible connections with the I'm Fatui. A spy. Oh, leave it to Master Jean to come up with such a thorough plan! <laughs> Perhaps such plans have become second nature after all the diplomatic issues I've dealt with. The name of the Lawrence clan member in question is Schubert. Lately, he can often be found strolling near the northern city walls. It is said that he is difficult to get along with due to his temperamental disposition, but if we approach him calmly, then things should go off without a hitch. Thanks again for your help. If you run into any snags along the way, I'll do anything in my power to support you. Okay. Hmm. Uh, 
That way. Are you? Hello, we're here to. Hello. What's wrong? Did you just say what's wrong? Huh. And I suppose you think that you can simply strut up here and greet me in such an ignoble and vulgar manner? Sorry Given that, that I don't recognize you, I can only assume that you are a traveler of some variety. I'll have yep. you know that you are speaking with THE Schubert Lawrence, a blood descendant of THE magnanimous nobility. If you wish to address me, you'd best consider your words more carefully. Such nonchalant manners are inadmissible and will never do. Now, if you're somehow capable of understanding anything I've said, then you will get down on your knees, apologize for your negligent actions, and give me a proper introduction. That is the appropriate etiquette. That's etiquette? Paimon's never heard of something so complicated before. Huh. In former times, when people knew their place and respected traditions, such conduct was only basic courtesy when greeting a nobleman. And neglecting your manners would result in a swift whipping. Oh, no. Ah. But look at the world now. Rules have been thrown to the wayside and manners forgotten. Ah, I cannot bear to see such degradation. What did you say? You dare question the dignity of the nobility? I'm not trying to! I'll have you know that though the Lawrence clan is in decline, myself and others of noble blood are looking for a chance to restore our rightful honor. Just look around. The people are unruly and undisciplined. I, however, strive to retain the elegance and etiquette of the nobility. After all, we are of a completely different breed by birth. Save your heck? words. I find your manners and bearing repulsive. I have nothing to discuss with the likes of you. Besides, I am in no way obligated to instruct commoners on basic courtesies. Now I have more pressing matters to attend to. I'll take my leave. What the heck? Ugh, so this gone is better. what Master G meant by difficult to get along with. <sighs> Let's get back and talk things over with her. Yeah, got her. Amber. Well, if it isn't the honorary knight, I'm just on my way out to gather some intel. I didn't expect to run into you here. Huh? Judging by your expression, you must have run into some trouble. Master Jean tasked us with a special assignment, but then... No need to get down on yourself. Sometimes things just don't turn out as planned. Even I can't guarantee useful intel every time I'm dispatched. You just have to keep at it and never give up. <laughs> hey, why don't you let me try to help? What's the problem? Master Jean asked us to build a connection with someone named Schubert Lawrence. But it turns out that he's a peculiar character that doesn't listen to anyone. Especially Paimon. Aha! Schubert! I know him! Let me guess, he said you didn't have any manners. <laughs> I've been on the receiving end of his lectures many a time. The Lawrence clan can be very particular about such things. Uh... You mean everyone in the Lawrence clan is just a big headache? Yeah. As aristocrats, they believe there should be a certain distance between themselves and common folk. Uh, I understand their thinking, but that's just not how things are anymore. Yeah, However, anymore. there is one exception among the Lawrence clan. My good buddy, Eula. Uh, buddy? 
That's right. Not only is she from the Lawrence clan, but she's also captain of the Knights of Favonia's fourth company. Eula is special. She's not quite like the other members of her clan. She has her own beliefs and it shows. In other words, nice. she doesn't really adhere to the strict rules and conventions of her family. However, she's still quite knowledgeable about dealing with the Lawrences. I'm sure you'll see what I mean if you meet her. Hmm, that's strange. If Eula is a member of the Lawrence clan, then why would Master Jean choose us for the task? Couldn't she just ask Eula? Uh, well, it's a little complicated. Basically, the Lawrence clan has frowned upon the fact that Eula joined the Knights. Oh, her family members don't particularly care for her. In their eyes, Eula is nothing but a traitor to the family. She's very easy to get along with. Just explain the situation, and I'm sure she'll help you come up with a way to get along with Schubert. In fact, I think she's out in the wilderness on patrol this morning. Uh, you should be able to find this her morning, around the Storm Mountains. Thanks, Amber. All right, morning. you herder, let's what? go find Eula. Good luck, you two. I've got my own matters to investigate. It's... It's night time. I think I stopped Paimon's talk. Uh, Stormbearer Mountains over here. Okay. My fan's not letting me do my, like, spinning. Well, if you want to learn about the conduct of the Lawrence clan, who better to ask than one of their own family members? Uh, you know what? Let's kill them all. <gasps> the what are they doing here? I agree. Skyward! This must be going to be a lot harder to kill. My ears poking me. No, no, it's not poking me. You know what I mean. Yeah. Actually, quite cool. <laughs> I should have screenshotted that. Damn it! You don't think twice before reaching for your sword, do you? <laughs> do you have any idea how long I've been tracking these targets? I'm sorry. And now you get to stake a claim. <laughs> you think you're stronger because you got to them first? <laughs> Mark my words, vengeance will be mine. Uh, what? That's right. I heard the commotion and came as swiftly as I could, only to find you two already fighting the Fatui. Not only that, you are making quick work of them, too. If I didn't make my move, you would have been able to take all the credit. Still, I'm glad you're unscathed. Confronting that number of Fatui at once can be dangerous. Uh, sorry, 
Paimon doesn't understand what you mean, but... Thanks for your concern! Concern? Why would I be concerned for the safety of my arch-enemies? Arch-enemies? Wait a minute! You were saying how glad you were that we were unscathed a second ago! By which I meant, if you were injured, I'd have to escort two strangers guilty of stealing my targets all the way back to Mondstadt. Where the which would mean you'd <laughs> cause me even more trouble. My vengeance would be swifter still. Huh? So that's how you see all this? Yes, that's me. Hyman thinks she's pretty strange. Although at least we can communicate with her. You dare to call someone you've just met strange? Forget the aristocracy. That's rude even by normal standards. Speaking of which, how do you know my name? This is the honorary knight of the Knights of Favonius. And speaking of rude, we're trying to investigate an aristocrat named Schubert Lawrence. He's so obsessed with etiquette that he's not even willing to speak with us. <laughs> I understand now. That's my uncle, all right. But why do you mean to investigate him? <sighs> I see. <laughs> you have some nerve to faming a family member right in front of me. I will have vengeance for this, too. What's with all this vengeance? No, no, no! This is an assignment from Master Jean! It's just an investigation, that's all! To the everyday citizens of Mondstadt, everyone in the Lawrence clan is scum. It's natural for rumors and unwarranted gossip to lead to such suspicion. Hard to avoid such a reputation when you're known as the ruthless rulers of old Mondstadt. Oh, so that's what you think of me? Hm. Yet another transgression to avenge. But, <laughs> didn't you say it first? Oh. <laughs> Curious. We've only just met, and you've already given me three causes for vengeance. It's been a while since I've encountered anyone as interesting as you. I assume you need me to teach you the conduct of the Lawrence clan. Only then will you finally be able to communicate with my uncle, correct? Correct. That's right. Amber told us to come and talk to you. Well then, let's begin your training immediately. It'll be easier to train when we're back in Mondstadt. We'll require other people. We can put that aside for now. Besides, if it's the acting Grandmaster's assignment, and Amber's the one who recommended me. I should comply. Yes. Uh, Hyman's confused. This girl's all vengeance this and revenge that. But she doesn't seem the least bit angry. Still, Hyman has met bigger weirdos before. I don't doubt that. Oh, wait, 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 I completely forgot. You got the new character. Hold up. You. Who was you again? Who was you again? Hold up, where do we find her again? Oh, I just saw a rainy day. I'm like, nah, <laughs> don't want to read it. Well, new character. Yeah, skyward, scatter. On my way. <laughs> ah, you finally arrived. There's no time to spare. So we'll begin with our first lesson. Wait, hold on. There's something we need to clear up first. Otherwise, it'll keep bugging us. So that's still on your mind, huh? Maybe you're the ones who can't let things... <laughs> Don't worry. There's a time and place for exacting vengeance. Besides, I'm not in the mood for any right now. Best save it for later. Uh, you need to be in the right mood for vengeance. I guess I so. already have a long list of vengeance to exact. Even if I wanted to begin now, I'd have to start in the right order. Uh. Who knows how long it will be before I get to you. Uh. <laughs> well, if you have so much to take care of, wouldn't it just be easier to give us a clean slate? Absolutely not. Stealing my targets, calling me a ruthless ruler, and suspecting my uncle. All worthy of vengeance in my eyes. 
But you needn't worry, at least not whilst we're investigating this matter. I'm sure you're familiar with the phrase, a man of moral integrity fears no slanderous attack. If Uncle Schubert didn't commit any wrongdoing, then any such investigation will prove fruitless. But if he did commit a wrongful act, then he should bear the full punishment. I'm sure you understand. Good. Now, there are two key points that aristocrats attach great importance to. Your manner of speech, and your bearing. Let's begin with your manner of speech. Aristocrats have a very unique way of carrying conversation, even with mundane daily topics. Oh, Paimon's already learned some unique conversation. Mark my words, vengeance will be mine! <laughs> <laughs> Not even close. And besides, it sounds strange. Hey! Paimon learned it from you! And didn't you say not to call others strange? It seems you don't respect the rules of your own clan! No, she doesn't. No, I've no need to trouble myself with such frivolous formalities. Here, allow me to demonstrate. For example, when greeting a friend, you could say, as the morning dew greets the coming dawn, so do I greet you, my dear friend. Uh, as the morning dew does what now? However, such a phrase may only be used during the morning hours. Also, the party with whom you're speaking must be of approximately the same status as you. Morning dew is not uncommon, so it expresses that friendship should not be measured by value, yet also suggests that friendship between aristocrats is pure like water. Oh, no, no, no. You must be prudent with your words. Calling someone a good friend could easily offend them. Uh, but didn't you just say my dear friend in your example? Paimon's confused. Yes, I did. But you must know in the Lawrence family, dear friend is a set phrase that can only be used towards certain friends with whom one is acquainted, but not particularly close. It sounds much more pleasant to call an acquaintance a dear friend. So, another thing to remember. Aristocrats are concerned with face and being polite. However, if you were to use dear friend to address an intimate friend, the recipient would think that you were deliberately trying to estrange them. This is only the first step in making a greeting. After addressing one another, you then exchange courtesies. Wait, wait! This is all too abstract! No, I understand all of this. Um, perhaps it would be better if you gave some real-life demonstrations. Ah. Very well. Come with me. We'll choose some bystanders to converse with. Okay. Oh, you're... You love the Lawrence clan, right? This can't be good. <clears throat> you there, lowly laborer. You stand in the presence of a member of the illustrious Lawrence clan. I have words for you. Please acknowledge the glory bestowed upon thee by the nobility... Uh... What comes next? Uh, oh, right. By solemnly kneeling to the ground with utmost sincerity. Huh? I can't make heads or tails of anything you're saying. Hold on. What did they always teach me? Whenever a dispute arises, protection of your family's prestige and dignity always takes precedence. Got it. <clears throat> As a lowly commoner, you shall maintain absolute reverence when speaking with those under which you so graciously toil. How dare you speak in such a manner? Ugh, is everyone from the Lawrence clan so strange? The days of the Lawrence clan's tyranny have long passed. I don't care what you're trying to do. Just beat it. Like I said, I don't care what you're doing. I have nothing to say to any member of the Lawrence clan. And here's a word of advice. I wouldn't be caught dead walking too closely with any one of their like in Mondstadt. If that's all, I'll be going. I'm afraid I won't be able to control myself if we talk any longer. Uh, hey, hey! Don't leave! Uh, halt! Wow. The Lawrence name really does carry a terrible reputation. Yep. <sighs> Never mind him. I could have predicted as much. Let's find someone else. How about someone that's more acquainted to you? Oh. <clears throat> you there, 
lowly toiler. You stand in the presence of a member of the illustrious Lawrence clan. I have words for you. Please acknowledge the glory bestowed upon thee by the nobility, and solemnly kneel to the ground with utmost sincerity. <sighs> huh? Why don't you respond? According to the custom, I must wait until you kneel completely before I can say the next words. Ah, right. I mustn't look at you too long, or I'll be drawing more attention to our difference in status. Oh dear, I've already stared at you for quite a while. <sighs> Fine. You may spare yourself the formality of kneeling, as it may be a little inconvenient. I shall continue. Oh, wait. I think there's a line for people with rude attitudes in this situation. Hey, stop bothering me or else uh... I might say something you wouldn't like to hear. Then again, I've got no words for anyone from the Lawrence clan. Again? What's with this attitude? Yes, I don't think his attitude will change. If I keep grandstanding like this, the outcome won't be good. Let's try to find someone else to talk to. Hm. I'll remember your unwillingness to comply. Ah, uh, the vengeance part. I can just... Yeah, what's up? This will just be an exact thing, right? He's already in a mad mood. Yeah. You there, lowly worker. I... Yeah, I've already heard it all before. Look, just spare me the time. Our answer's always the same. We've got nothing to say to the likes of you. I mean, seriously, can't you just take a hint? Please calm down. We don't want to cause any trouble. Ah, I know she's a knight of Favonius, and that the knights wouldn't misplace their trust, but the name Lawrence carries too much weight with it. Even to this very day, the descendants of the Lawrence clan are still scheming to reclaim Mondstadt and reinstate their aristocratic rule. And if that wasn't enough, here you are purposefully using their awkward way of speaking just to put on an act? Don't you care for the feelings of us ordinary folk? You have a point, but mark my words, this transgression will not- <laughs> Huh? You wanna fight? Uh, Listen here, I may be no match for you, but I'll be sure to lodge a complaint with the Knights of Favonius. I'm sorry, but I want her to understand that I'm serious. Listen here, if you don't want things to get more unpleasant, then you'd better just stop. Forget it. There's no point in quarreling any further. Let's go. <sighs> oh, whoa, Ranger's lag horde. It's all right. This happens quite often. Let's find someone else to talk to. Uh, Paimon thinks we've seen enough now. Let's just stop. Actually, Paimon thinks we should apologize for asking you to demonstrate for us. We had no idea the feelings between the Lawrence clan and the people of Mondstadt were so bitter. <laughs> what can we do? The Lawrence name is already a dirty word among every household in Mondstadt. Even three-year-olds know the story. I see this kind of attitude all the time. <sighs> Don't worry. What with me being a knight of Favonius, they're usually willing to speak a few words with me. Perhaps my aristocratic manner of speech provoked them today. Believe me, it's not a big issue. So this is the way things are normally for you? There's no need for them to direct their anger at you personally. That's the way things are. Perhaps it's just fate for those who have made mistakes. Accepting punishment is only fair, right? But when your family has committed atrocities, I'm afraid there's no easy path to reconciliation. That's As memories one. are carried in the city breeze, the faults of such grievances are passed from one generation to the next. It is now my turn to bear this burden. At least I have a means of living a relatively normal life compared to the elders of my family. I have nothing to be discontented about. Yeah! Why were you so willing to try and demonstrate for us? Oh, that reminds me. That last person will not escape my vengeance either. <sighs> Let's leave it at that. Just think of it as something I like to do. But unfortunately, you probably didn't learn much from those conversations. It seems we have no other choice but to find more people to talk to. Uh, no need! Besides, the Traveler's pretty sharp, and nothing gets in our way on an adventure. Paimon thinks we got the gist of it now, right? Right? We'll just have to roll with it for now. 
Let's just keep Eula from getting anyone else riled up. Well then, I'm glad you learned something. You're already halfway toward mastering aristocratic conduct. That's halfway? A proper manner of speech is more aesthetic than anything else. It stems from their taste for refinement. But we must also practice your bearing. I have a very effective way of training for this. Come with me to Dragonspine. Okay. Let's go. Uh, uh, oh yeah, okay. Hmm. No, I'm not gonna do that type of challenge. Half the video will be walking. So I'm just thinking of if I was just to do like a walking one. No portals, nothing. Straight walking. Yeah, what's up? It's so cold. Does aristocrat training really need to be done here? If you wish to truly achieve the dignified conduct of an aristocrat, you must learn to remain composed and elegant even amidst harsh conditions. For example, you can see that part of the path up ahead is quite difficult to traverse. But a well-trained aristocrat would not only effortlessly proceed forward, but do so without a stain on their garment and their elegance fully intact. Hyman thinks we've left the realm of aristocrats and entered the realm of adventuring. Compared to what we've already seen, this should be a piece of cake. Hyman thinks so too, but you've got this in the bag. <laughs> you look pretty confident this time. All right, let's get started. Remember, you must be graceful and elegant. Don't get knocked or launched into the air. That would be most unsightly. Um... That won't do. You've exposed your shortcomings. What? No need to worry. It'll be difficult at first. Remember, you must... You. That won't do. You've exposed your shortcomings. What? No need to worry. Head back to the starting. It'll be dip. Remember. I'm only gonna get harmed that way. Ah, uh, what? No getting hit. Hell you. <sighs> that won't do. You've exposed your shortcomings. What? No need to worry. Head back to the starting point and try again. What? Okay, I'm just gonna go. It'll be difficult, remember. Yep. Got ya! All taking any damage. Yeah. You're taking damage. Oh no. Skyward. Oi. Ha ha. Not bad. A lot better than I had anticipated at least. I almost didn't make it through. Good thing we didn't get stuck. Um so are we aristocrats now? Not aristocrats. <laughs> aristocrats. Don't flatter yourselves. We've only just begun. Mm -hmm. This scenario was relatively simple. In the face of a real battle, one would seldom have a chance to stop and evaluate the situation. There's a ley line monolith just up ahead that will attract nearby monsters. True elegance is the ability to calmly yet swiftly make decisions in the heat of battle. My family set only the highest expectations for me. Even as a child. Let's proceed, shall we? Mm hmm we Shall. 
This is the ley line monolith. Go ahead, activate it. But be careful not to get launched into the air or frozen while fighting. That would be most unsightly. Yeah! Scatter! Skyward! Dissipate! I did that wrong. Got her. with me. That was much easier. Well done. Your performance was most impressive. And you managed to remain calm even in these grueling dragon spine surroundings. <laughs> I'm starting to wonder if even I could have done the same. Given such an outstanding performance, it seems there is little left for me to teach you. Like Paimon said, adventuring is our specialty! Uh, <laughs> so, that's it for our training, right? Then let's get out of dragon spine before Paimon turns into a popsicle! Hold on. I was commending the Traveler's performance just now. You, on the other hand, seem to have made no progress at all. Uh, what? You mean Paimon was also part of the training? Yes, of course. You were frantically flying and dashing about throughout the entire thing. Not an elegant sight at all. Did you even listen to anything I was trying to teach you? Uh, hey! That's not true! Paimon was just focusing on you the whole time! Whatever the reason, not heeding my instructions. A cause for vengeance, perhaps. Huh. Four now, counts. drink this. Huh? What is it? <gasps> Are you trying to poison Paimon? Certainly not. It's warm milk. Didn't you just say that you were freezing? Drink it and it'll help warm you up. Oh, uh, thank you. Um, are you still planning on the whole vengeance thing? If I wasn't, then why would I care about you being cold? If you turned into a Paimon popsicle, that would ruin my plans for vengeance now, wouldn't it? So, dear friend, don't die on me out here. Ah! Paimon knew something was off! All in the name of vengeance. No need to thank me. Now then, given that your training is complete, it's time we return to Mondstadt. Our last step will be preparing a cordial gift to present to my uncle when you meet him. I already have something in mind. Let's pay Sarah a visit at Good Hunter. Radio? Imagine walking all the way back. I know some people do it, but still. It's not something I do. I don't want to do that. My hand is so stiff. Why are my hands so stiff? I haven't been gaming. Oh, hello there. Outrider Amber. Oh, hey, Eula. I see you've met the honorary knight. We meet again, Amber. Seems we're just bound to run into you these days. Well, I just got back and was thinking about grabbing a bite at Good Hunter. But now that you're here, why don't we all eat together? Very well. It's been some Hi, time everyone. since we've last shared a meal together. Come, take a seat. We can discuss my uncle's gift while we eat. Hmm. Yes? Is there something else you'd like to order? Could you please prepare a serving of my uncle's favorite, Gebrotenes Fleisch mit Sauerkraut? We'll take it as a gift to him later. Coming right up! <laughs> It'll take some time to prepare. I'll have it here at the counter once it's ready. Yay. Uh, hold on a moment. Is this satisfying salad also something that Amber ordered? No, she didn't order it. But because she didn't order any vegetables, I thought I'd throw in a salad on the house. You know, to contrast all the meat dishes. <laughs> so, we clearly didn't order this, yet you prepared it without authorization. <laughs> wow. Mark. Uh, you're gonna take revenge on her for giving us a free salad? Hmm. You should know me by now. That's the kind of villainous character I am. Well then, uh, please wait a moment while I get the dish for your uncle started. <laughs> Delicious unauthorized delicacies. 
Sarah will pay for this. What? Why would you choose Gibraltinus Fleischmidt sauerkraut as a gift for your uncle? Hyman's never even heard that dish before. This dish isn't actually on Good Hunter's menu. Only long-standing patrons such as my uncle would know about the dish. The old aristocrat seemed to take a liking to it. Because of the sour flavor of the sauerkraut, not too many people are fond of it these days. I guess it's become less popular over time. Mm -hmm. Eula treated me to the dish once, and I couldn't even finish a bite. I've nicknamed it Gebratenes Fleisch mit Vengeance ever since. Ugh. I never expected us to have such completely different tastes in food. If I weren't in such a good mood, I'd say that constitutes grounds for transgression. Of course not. It's hard to find someone in Mondstadt that attracts contempt as much as she does. <laughs> it's fine when you're just joking between us, but I'm afraid our honorary knight might misunderstand you. A lot. <laughs> Eula's always talking about vengeance, but that's just how she is. It's nothing you should take too seriously. But I am serious, and I'll remember every transgression committed against me. Ugh, it's no wonder so many people dislike you. Paimon's starting to realize that you is actually a very good person. There's no need to be so awkward when you want to say something nice. <sighs> Listen, you've never been labeled as a social pariah, have you? What? Uh, well... No? So that's why you wouldn't understand how hard it is for a bad person to try to be good. It's impossible for me, and I have no intention of acting like a good person. All right, no need to look so sullen. I'm just kidding. Come on, let's eat. The food is getting cold. Did I order a whole basket of vegetable vegetables? Oh, I'm stuffed. I'll see Sarah about the bill. No need. I've left the mora under the plate. If you try to settle it with her in person, she won't accept payment for the salad. Don't underestimate my ability to exact revenge. That revenge? <laughs> Sarah won't get the upper hand this time. All right. Next, you should pay my uncle a visit. He has a small camp at the top of the mountain near Springvale. He usually whiles his time away there when there's nothing else to do. Right here? Uh, aren't you coming with us, Yua? I'm afraid that wouldn't be very convenient for me. It'd be better if you two went alone. Ah, yes. Please do remember to pick up the dish from Sarah. I still have more recon to do in the wilderness. Well, until next time! Let's meet again. What an interesting bunch you are. Here, the Gabratinus Fleischmitz sauerkraut is ready to go. How can you say that <laughs> Be sure to um, eat it while it's hot. Gabratinus Otherwise, the flavor will be spoiled. Nope. And by the way, don't worry too much when Eula says strange things. She's actually a very good person. Hyman's been meaning to ask. No one could stand the sight of Eula when she was trying to speak with the others in Mondstadt early. But she seemed to get along fine with you and Amber just now. What's up with that? The people of Mondstadt don't take kindly to anyone bearing the Lawrence name. They are unable to see past her family, therefore they don't actually see Eula for herself. So no matter what Eula tries to do, it's seen as a wrongdoing. It essentially strips the meaning of anything she tries to accomplish. How come you're able to see Eula differently then? Well, when she joined the Knights of Favonius, it caused quite an uproar. Many people signed a petition demanding that the Knights reverse their decision. At the same time, numerous members of the Lawrence clan crowded the entrance of the Knights of Favonius headquarters, clamoring for Eula to give an explanation. Oh, so both sides were unhappy. That's right. Yeah, so you can imagine how determined Eula must have been under such circumstances. But thanks to Grandmaster Varka and the unwavering attitudes of others in the Knights of Favonius, they were able to quell the unrest. Tensions still remain beneath the surface, I'm afraid. In the eyes of the people, she's a stain on the Knights of Favonius. Mm. And in the eyes of the Lawrence clan, she's a disgrace to her family. But she simply fulfills her duty as a knight, silently helping one person after another, myself included. People Gosh. like Eula should be approached with care and understanding. She could stand to be treated a little more fairly. I believe a day will come when things will get better. One day. Once everything's settled, we should go talk to Yula again. Paimon thinks we know how to communicate with her now. I'm glad. I think that would make her very happy. 
though she might not ever admit it. Take care. Please come again. Oh, hell no. Uh... This one. Seems I dipped my toes in the water. Oh well. I am yet to do the challenge here as well. I, I shall do that afterwards. The tent seems to be pretty tattered, but there's a really fancy chair. Could this be another aristocratic custom? Ah, it's you again. I thought I had rid myself of you two. A few humble words, huh? Yes, that sounds appropriate enough. Very well. I'm certainly not one to be narrow-minded. I'll overlook your previous misconduct for now and listen to what you have to say. Wow, this guy thinks so highly of himself. Hmm. It appears I have misjudged you. Supreme brilliance. The glory of the nobility that continues to this day. A true loyalist. Impressive. My intentions were to test your humility. It appears you have become well versed in our etiquette. Oh, so he was testing us. Sheesh, what an ordeal. Your conduct is satisfactory. I must say, such progress in such a short time is practically unfathomable. If I may ask, from whence did you learn such a civilized manner of speech? Ah, good. Very good. You are bright, and compared with the common folk of Mondstadt, you certainly have potential. If you were of aristocratic blood, your prospects would be promising indeed. By the way, we brought a gift! Ahem. Paimon means we would like to present you with a small token of our goodwill. Huh? Could this be? Gebratnis Fleisch meets Sauerkraut? It's evident that your sentiment is genuine. As a young person nowadays, only with no small effort could you achieve such a dish. It's been so long since I dug into a big, tasty... Uh, I, I beg your pardon. What I mean to say is, since it's nearly mealtime, I shall partake. I'm not saying that word. Ah, yes. This aroma, just as I remember it. And this exquisite sour flavor. Mmm. A delicacy that only us noblemen and women could appreciate. Now even Paimon's starting to wonder what it tastes like. I acknowledge your genuine goodwill. Such sincerity must certainly imply that you come bearing a request. There's gonna be mad. It's gonna. Uh, wait, so you've come to know of this too? It was meant to be a family secret. Hmm. Well, considering your meticulous etiquette, you must be a talent of unusual fortitude. I'm willing to place my full trust in you. Please, come with me. We happen to be in need of competent fellows like yourself. When you're an enemy, do not put your trust in me. To see some friends from a distant land. They have offered their assistance in restoring the Lawrence clan to its former glory. So he trusts us solely based on your etiquette? Well then, let's get going, shall we? You'll understand everything in due course. Okay, so this is where the movement part goes to. Things will get sticky if the Fatui happen to recognize you. What should we do? 
I have no idea. This may also be another test. Oh. Oh no. That's our quest. We need to not get hit. Keep everything at a distance for now. Hop to it, Monzai. Oh, underneath, you gotta be kidding me. Behind enemy lines, of course, it's called that. Right, let's get going. That looks about right. Hmm? Huh? Why have you put on a mask all of a sudden? Hmm. Even if they are powerful, our status is much higher than theirs in the land of Mondstadt. And therefore, we shouldn't allow them to admire our true faces so easily. I see. <laughs> Good thinking. Paimon thought for sure they'd recognize us. Let's proceed, shall we? I'll introduce you as my guest. They'll recognize Paimon. Oh, I actually As do you'll see in a moment, mask. there are many already helping us. I heard that this area had already been purged once by the Knights of Favonius, but it's the only place around Mondstadt that is well concealed and spacious enough. Although it has fallen into disrepair and does not suit the tastes of the nobility, we simply have to make due for now. Uh, sorry, um, can we walk any faster? Of course not. An aristocrat always moves with grace in his steps. Moving hurriedly is unacceptable. What's the button again? As expected, it's the Fatui! As expected? We always see them around the city. Um, they must be very powerful. <laughs> huh. Nothing more than foreign ruffians with power and the ability to flaunt it. But they are favorable bit. Hold it right there! Who's this? If you really must know, they're my guests. If you happen to offend them in even the slightest, then you will be held accountable yes. by the Lawrence clan. But this matter is of utmost secrecy. We must exercise caution. You dare question the ways of a nobleman? I don't have time for this. Make way. No need to sound all high and mighty like that. <sighs> Fine. You may proceed. They don't dare to question you. <laughs> of course. That is the benefit of prestige. In past times, it would be a dire offense to speak to a nobleman in such a manner. We could determine a person's fate with the blink of an eye. <laughs> and such glory will return to me again before long. Huh. Where have I seen this person before? Nowhere. And who, may I ask, is this? We mustn't bring just anyone in here. This is our new ally that I've recently met. They are completely trustworthy. You have the word of the Lawrence clan. Our plans are strictly confidential. It's not wise to bring in an outsider at this time. Furthermore, there's been word that an outlander who joined the Knights of Favonius has been very active in Mondstadt recently. Don't be ridiculous. Besides, my guest is well versed in the etiquette of the nobility. 
I must treat them with the proper mutual respect. The Knights of Favonius pay no regard to such details. They could never understand the intricacies of our etiquette. And what about this thing? Uh, you mean Paimon? Enough! You dare question my word? Need I remind you who it is who has made your activity in Mondstadt possible? Without the support of the Lawrence clan, you would have all been driven out by the Knights of Favonius like dogs. You must immediately offer your sincerest apologies to my friend. You've offended their honor. Fine. I'll take your word and make no further inquiries. Now, to the matter at hand. Did you bring the diagram of Mondstadt's defenses as promised? Oh, so that's what's going on here. Yes, of course. Here it is. Let me see. Huh. Why is it so poorly drawn? Everything's so squiggly and crooked. A and what is this shape supposed to be? Excuse me. I'll have you know that I went to great lengths to carefully draw this map by hand. Ma that shape is the symbol of the Knights of Favonius. Huh. I see. Crude, but I can make do. Are you able to verify that this is all reliable information? Of course, you needn't worry about that. Don't forget what we agreed upon. The flag of the Lawrence clan will fly above the Knights of Favonius headquarters. The rights to that building, as well as the whole of Mondstadt, belong to the Lawrence clan. Yes, yes, we will both profit from this agreement. There's no use haggling over the details. We will make good use of the intel you provided. Also, be certain not to divulge our identity. There would be... diplomatic consequences, you know. Don't worry, this matter is only between you and I. And my new friend here. No one else will know of it. Once this is over, I shall stand atop the Favonius headquarters and rebuke their pathetic rule over Mondstadt. Then, the city and all its people will once again be under the rightful and unwavering rule of the Lawrence clan. Damn. <laughs> Perfect. Just as it once was, and just as it should be. May I remind you once again that we mustn't act rashly. That is all for now. Very well. Huh? What are you doing? This was all just a ploy to deceive me! It's your own fault! Who would put so much trust in someone based purely on their manners? After so much planning, this is how it ends? Huh! We'll see about that! Where fight me? Just as I expected. I knew I should have never trusted these foolish aristocrats. No matter, we already have the intel we need. Get them! Running off in different directions. Paimon remembers that this place is a dead end. Let's take care of the Fatui first and then deal with Chuber later. Can't run. Well. Strike clouds converge. Don't be a killjoy. We've only just begun. Is that all you got? Hell you. Can't run. No. Well. Got her! Got her! Crumble apart! Oh, joy! We've only just begun! Starfall! Shield, 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 yes. It's a waste of time. It looks like I went too far. Let's end this quickly! Mighty mythical beast! Gotcha! Dissipate! Starfall! 
want to see something. I'm dead. I am so dead. Exactly sure when I'd get another chance to heal everyone. My way. I'll leave on my own. It seems we finally caught up with you. This place is crawling with Fatui. Oh, it's you. It seems your investigation went well. Aha! I see now. So you're the one that taught them our etiquette. And I thought you despised such pleasantries. Furthermore, there is a rule in our family. Such traditions are never to be taught to outsiders. Ah, yes. Rings a bell. So what? I had no reason not to teach them. You have brought shame to our family and ruined my plans. It's all for naught now. I know that you poured great efforts into these plans, Uncle. But you were well aware that it was not the right thing to do. As a Knight of Favonius, I could not overlook your actions. Knight of Favonius? Let's get one thing straight. I am your uncle, and you are a member of the Lawrence clan. You should strive to restore your family's glory. You still have a chance. Defeat every Knight of Favonius here, and leave with me. Then I shall plead with the family to spare you, and give you a new beginning. So just to be clear, you want a Knight of Favonius to attack the Knights of Favonius? I shall say this one last time. You are not a Knight of Favonius. You are a descendant of the Lawrence clan. The blood of the Lawrence clan flows it's in shaking. your veins. You must comply with the will of the family. Since when have I ever complied with the will of the family? Why, you... you unruly maid! If anyone should be angry, it should be me. As a member of the Lawrence clan, you knowingly plotted against the city of Mondstadt and threatened its safety. Had you ever stopped to consider the trouble it would bring to so many people? Had you considered how many enemies you would make trying to keep the plans under wraps? Y you dare lecture me! That's right. In the name of the family that you so dearly revere, Uncle Schubert. I've never experienced the age of glory you always speak of. And I've never understood our family's incessant pursuit of it. But I am capable of discerning right from wrong. And I deeply understand what freedom means to the people of Mondstadt. The Lawrence clan should never and will never become what you've dreamed it to be. Oh, the disgrace of it all! How could such a rebellious monster emerge from our own family? Huh. Things are starting to get pretty hysterical here. Politeness and elegance seem to have gone out the window. That's enough fuss for today. You two, take him away. The Honorary Knight and I have other matters to attend to. <sighs> Given that you've already taken action, I assume you've come across some conclusive evidence? Paimon took a peek at their diagram. Your uncle had mapped out all of the Knight's patrol routes and marked out key information about Mondstadt. <sighs> and there was me thinking that he was just another elder of the family. And a lazy one at that. I never suspected he could stoop this low. So stubborn. Mark my words, vengeance will be mine. Let's discuss this later. Our first priority is recovering that diagram. Let's go, shall we? <laughs> mm. Time for this. Oh wait. 
You can join our side. Crush. Bro. Huh? Wait. At the end of her attack. No, okay. They're here. Stop them. That hard enough skill will do you no good. Crush! Get your skill away from me, dude. Fake for mercy. Get with me. I do like her gameplay. Shudder. Oh. Yep, of course. Beg for mercy. Yeah. 
well, there we go. This must be it. They may very well have already made a copy of it, but without my uncle as their puppet, there'd be no use in them attacking the city. The Fatui wouldn't have relied only on your uncle. True. But if their plan had hinged purely on taking Mondstadt by force, as opposed to with the help of a puppet, they could have spared themselves the trouble. The Fatui are dishonest, but they wouldn't go as far as to start an open war. Their opposition wouldn't just be Mondstadt alone. Anyway, I'll inform the acting Grand Master. She'll know how to handle things from here. Oh yeah! You suddenly appeared at just the right moment! Yeah, about that. Because you stole my targets by attacking the Fatui I'd been tracking earlier, I came to exact my vengeance. You tried to do my job for me, and I'm here to return the favor. Finally! After all this time, Paimon understands what you're saying! In reality, you sense that something might happen to us during our investigation. You were worried about us and your uncle, so you brought a team to take a look. My purpose was vengeance. Don't twist the story. <laughs> you don't look too bright, but it turns out you have a knack for scheming. Yay. And mark my words, I'll remember that. Hey, what do you mean Paimon doesn't look the too bright? The thing's gone. It's gone. You have seeded a deep enmity between us. Just you wait. Even if you were to be completely destroyed, I would never forget you. Bring it on! <laughs> I like your fighting spirit. I'll take this diagram back yep. to the Knights of Favonius and take it. Sure! Well, see you around. That you will. And make sure not to steal my targets next time. Nice. That was a good quest. Number two. Let's go. Hmm. I would say that because it's like the holidays and stuff, I would stream for a lot longer, but I wouldn't be able to, probably a little bit longer, but not too much. Boom, boom. Where do you want this stuff delivered to, boss? Oh yeah, oh no. That's what I was forgetting this entire time, I knew it was something. I'm creating too much butter. Oh, cheese. Oh, well. Um. There it is. Seventeen. Nice. So now. What other quests? I do want to do another story quest, but I don't want to do any of their story quests. Zuma, Leeway, Leeway, Fontaine. That's I can't do Fontaine. Close that up. Uh, what is all of this? I'm guessing more Fontaine and stuff. Um, Leeway. Chasm seems like a good place to go. Right there is the mission. Right here is what was it again? Oh, that was the part for that other person. 
Or you all also would get the gladiator stuff. Yep, I understand now. Artio. An apple that day keeps the doctor away. Oh yeah, there's no sound. That was it to the quest. Hold up. That's continuing the quest? Damn, I didn't even know. I just wanted to go here to get the, like, upgrade my thing if possible. I did not read any word of that. This one's right here, that one's even further down. I need to destroy this thing somehow, and I'm not sure how. Wait a minute, is it this? And how do I destroy it? Oh. Okay. What do I do with this over here? Just right, come here, Roll. Yeah, skyward. Straight clouds converge. I mean that. Congratulations. Golden insignia. Oh, yes. I would need that. This stuff looks dope. Lucky charm. 
Let's just stop. A bunch of crystal charms, eh? Wondering how we got rid of those things. I don't have any left. Ah, on top of the water filtration is this one. Boom. Many happy returns. Have you? Stop it now! Why? Hey, oh. what gives? Oh, I thought it would have been up here again. Hold up. Move up. What does it mean by move up? How far up? Where am I going? What? Where do you want this stuff delivered to, boss? Is this an entrance to the chasm now? Whoa! I didn't even know this was here. Like, at all. Oh well, going back down then. Enter! Didn't even know that was there. Oh no. Just got darker. Um, Yeah. 
Pass them easy. Where is one? Where is one? Where is one? Where is one? There. So we need to get more of them. Where do you want this stuff delivered to, boss? <laughs> right back to the camp, but first I need to do that because then I can come back to you. I want to get all of them little things. So my light can be brighter. Okay, now it needs that much. Be right back. Uh, yeah. I know, wrong area, that's slow. Hold up. Yeah. <laughs> 
I want one of them things. Just one more. get rid of that without an extra one I can get rid of that one is there any more light things This is a random pedestal over here. Oh, there's one down there, so I'll get that in a moment. Yeah, in a moment's notice. Ten K? Whoa. Seems to be another one near this location. Is it down there? Perhaps it is. Hmm. I don't think I got the right height. Bounce. I don't know what would bounce at this height. Like, at all. Like... Well... Oh well. Luxury chest. Yeah. Skyward. Regenerate that, bring it over here. them for one's perusal. I've done that part. Let's hope it's the right thing. Supposedly, there's different types. My first, <laughs> my first time noticing this. Yes, I do wish to refine. Yay!
I'm gonna crown the man. So. Level 2 using Probably one of that. 9. I guess I have four now. Yeah. Oh, we're nearing the time of off. Oh no, let's see if we can get this all done. There's a crafting thing down here. I have no idea what these are for. Okay. We can craft a geo one of this. I can craft four of that. See, there's no real need. Mm -hmm. No idea how you craft what into what is that? Uh, it doesn't rhyme this way. Makes three special unremove unmoving essential oils. Oh. No. We have enough. I guess. Um. Okay. I had somehow collected frogs somewhere. I, I must have done. I must have done it while just walking around. Thanks for the trouble. Yay! We have more expansion to the map. A lot of rustling. Was I supposed to get man? I don't know. Oh well. Wait, if there's gonna be explosion Ah, oh, okay. And then that would weave more into that hour down there. Yep, that makes more sense. So that just goes around there, that can go around that way itself as well. So that's the way I needed to go to go down all here. Although you can kind of see it. Now we need to go over there. Radio. We may need to leave that for the next episode. Um, because I'm getting quite tired and... Well, yeah. Wait, what do I have two? Oh. So... Yeah, that's my main character so far. So yeah. I hope all of you had a wonderful time watching today. I do hope... Wait a minute. I can ascend this guy.
doesn't really cost that much. Yeah, I'm gonna slowly level this guy up in the background. So yeah, I hope all of you all enjoy all of you enjoyed watching. I definitely enjoyed ma um, making this video. So I hope to see you all here next time. I hope, uh, and I hope to at least post once a month. Um, I'll see you all next month, I guess. Bye-bye.